Both teams getting their final warm-ups in as we welcome you back to the MLB pregame show. First pitch of game two in our series is right around the corner. But before we turn that corner, here is our Topps player spotlight. Big Daddy Slugger is our subject. And he's coming off a very nice game in which he racked up four hits and just looked dialed in at the plate. Yeah, anytime you get yourself four base knocks in a game, you're doing something right. He might have gotten a couple of gifts in terms of good pitches to hit, but, you know, it's not about the pitches you get. It's what you do with them. And from what I saw, the balls were flying all over the yard off his bat. Well, that performance was big for his team, and I'm sure they're hoping he can do it again in this one. All right, the guys and I will be back to get this one started on the show right after this. The California Coastal Layers sits overhead as we welcome you to baseball from historic Dodger Stadium. Tonight, the second of three to start the week between the Colorado Rockies and the Los Angeles Dodgers. It's Dodger baseball on the show, and it comes your way next. And a moment now to peek at the Rockies' starting lineup. How do they get back into the win column, Psycho? Well, they're facing a guy today that throws a lot of strikes, so you're going to have to be aggressive early in the count, but get the ball up in the zone. Shorten up a little bit, put the ball in play. Scott Kazmir is on the mound for game two. EK, what's the word on him? Yeah, Matt, he, he did his job in his last start. He threw seven complete innings, but still didn't get a decision. We'll see if he can get the W this time around. Big Daddy Slugger gets his first cuts now. The bases are empty, and there are two away here in the opening frame. Yeah, nothing doing so far here. He kind of needs to put up a tough at-bat right here just to make this guy work a little bit. Hard hit ball to second. Run it out, run it out, dig! Throw to first, he'll get him easily, and the side is retired. Marwin Gonzalez will dig in now. Off to a slow start, as you see there. Just barely over the 200 mark here in April. Now a ball grounded to short. This could be two. The second for one. Back to Adrian, and it's a double play. And with that, let's look at how the Dodgers align on defense. It's brought to us by Majestic. Eric, what do we need to know? Well, guys, remember... This manager is not jumped on board with all the defensive shifts. Still that old school mentality. Plays guys straight up. So we'll see how that impacts. This. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Big Daddy Slugger. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Yeah, ground out last time. But you know with his speed, that's kind of a big part of the way he plays the game. Put the ball on the oh, ground no, and force the defense player. to make a clean, quick play on him. Because if they don't, he's safe. Well, that base hit is going to get his hit streak to six games now. So he's swinging it. Kike Hernandez is at the plate now. Flied out in his first at-bat. One run on three hits. No errors for the Dodgers thus far. Runners off for second. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Blackman is under it. Two down. So a runner at first with two away. And now the left-handed hitting Adrian Gonzalez will get a shot. A runner on, on first now. with two away. Chopped weakly to the left. Scooped up over to LeMayhew, covering at the bag, and that ends the inning. So no runs on a hit here, no errors, one man left on. We played four full, all tied at one and one. Nolan Arenado will stand in now. He singled and struck out in two right, trips. Two. 
fielded cleanly. There's one. Back to first, and a great stretch there may be the difference. It's a double play, and the inning is over. Four to six to three. They roll it up to get out of the jam. Back with more here on a Tuesday night after this. Big Daddy Slugger will dig in. One for two. He grounded out the first time and followed that with a base hit in his second plate appearance. See it, drive it. Let's go, big dog. Stung into the gap in right center for what should be extra bases. Right here, find the ball. Oh, and he misses the stop sign there as he heads for the plate. And they will tag him out at the plate. And that'll keep our ball game tied up as the inning is over. One left for L.A. Score remains tied one to one. Gerardo Parra will come forward now in what could be an at-bat that goes a long way toward deciding this ball game. And they better be careful, too, because they haven't gotten him out yet. So this is no small task. They got to hold him right here. Come on. Go-ahead runs in scoring position here with nobody out. Sent on backhanded and a rather easy first out. Well, good fundamental baseball might just win him this ball game. You've got the go ahead run at second base, so this guy knows exactly what he has to do. Just a simple ground ball to the right side gets that guy to third base, and now you've got all sorts of ways to get him in and grab a late lead. Leading off the inning, Big Daddy Leading Slugger, up, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. You know, guys, I love a guy like this Slugger. leading off an inning for you. He makes good contact, and he can run. Hey, get your pitch up there. Come on, now. Hey, drive that pitch. Oh, here we oh, go. High. Deep. That is a moonshot, folks. A long home run. Solo shot to right center. Seven home runs for him on the year now. And the Dodgers are back within a run at 3-2 to two now. One rule for being a successful closer, you got to keep the ball in the ballpark. And he's still got a lead to work with after this home run, but his margin for error is pretty much gone now. Not a lot of offense to go around in this one, but what offense we did see came from this man's bat. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, you see a couple of hits for him in the ball game. This one was tight throughout, but in the end, he really helped lead his guys to this victory. So that just about does it. For EK, Psycho, and the crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, get those smartphones and tablets out and head over to the shownation.com. The Rockies come out on top 3 to 2. Good night from Los Angeles. The final line score for our ball game tonight for the victorious Rockies. Three runs on seven hits. No errors. They left five men on base. For the Dodgers. Two runs on 11 hits. One error. They left 10 men on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 46 minutes. So we've got a pinch hitter moving into the on-deck circle now as he'll bat with runners at first and third, and still nobody out in the inning. One time right here. Now batting, third baseman. Big Daddy Slugger. That boy. 
This is hit high and deep out to left. Para looking up, and this one is gone. A home run. So a three-run blast to straightaway left. Eighth home run on the season for him. And with it, the Dodgers have opened it up to a 5-0 lead. Wow. He has proven to be a real nuisance in the first two games of this series. A home run in last night's ball game, and now another one here. Well, you always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man went above and beyond in this one. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, I thought he turned in a really good performance. His fastball had some good life to it. He really mixed his speeds well, and he kept guys guessing all throughout. So that'll just about do it. For Eric Harrow, Steve Lyons, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshownation.com. The Dodgers win it 9-2. to two. So long from Southern California. Here now is our final line score this afternoon for the victorious Dodgers.